YouTube. Okay, so back again with another video. Uh, sorry about the mess. It's um, getting near the silly season, so we stocked up with a few drinks and that. So I've got to put them away yet. But anyway, back on track. Um, I wanted to show you uh, not this item because I think I've showed you this in the video before because that does disc images for the C64, so it plays everything disc, obviously. And it's this image, this uh, device here. I got chat chatting to a guy on um, the Facebook group and he kindly made me this and um, sent it to me and I've got to be honest absolutely blown away it's got to be one of the best things I think I've got it's um, it's a tape deck emulator so it emulates the 64 uh, tape deck but it's 100% load I've not had anything fail and um, yeah, it's an SD card on the side, so everything, all the games are on there in .tap. And um, I'll just quickly cut to the night time now, and I'll show you it running. Okay, so as if by magic, it's now darkness. I'll try and not show you the screen because it flickers quite a lot. Um, right, so this is the gadget. I'll just power it off and back on. I'll try and focus on the screen. Should be fun. Right, so you have mode play there. Then what you do is you hit this button here. You want it on play as it was. That's it. Then this one. Right, so I have a favourites folder on the SD. I've also got alphabetical. And I also put all the games on from the forthcoming uh, C64 Mini, what's been released. So I'll put all the games that are on that as well in that folder. But I'll just go back to my favourites. So 1942, 720 Airwolf and stuff. So I'll just quickly show you how this works. So if I press on Avenger, right, load the game. It says press play on tape. So what you do is you just press play on there like that. Already the screen's gone blue. Avenger, it says 2%. 3% so when it gets to 100 that means it's loaded it also does the usual found with pauses as well see the little workings there The light there indicates that it's got good, um, it's hearing connect correctly with the talking to the system, um, to the 64 if that makes sense. So it's, they're both talking, communicating fine. Screen's going for it here. God, it's not like that sync at all, does it? But anyway, you get the gist of it. But no, I just think this is absolutely the bee's knees. Can't fault it. Okay, I'll leave you with it. Thanks for watching.